So my daughter is going to be out of harm's way. My grandson will be living right next door. Well, wow, it's a gift from heaven. <laughs> what about your son? Yeah, what about your other son? Yeah, we're gifts from heaven too, right, Ma? Yeah, yeah, shut it and eat your bucatini. <laughs> You okay? Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. Just distracted. The, the baby's improving, right? Yes, on every level. And her labs are almost normal. Most people would say that with a smile. I know, I know, but it just doesn't make sense, and I'm having a hard time accepting it. Okay. Come with me. Where are we going? Just a place I like to think. Um, we'll be right back. I know I should just be happy, and I am. Anna is going to live a long and healthy life. It's just, it bothers me that I can't explain it. You know, more some things don't have an explanation. Yeah, but the science was indisputable. There was no reason to expect an improvement, much less a recovery. And yet it happened. Well, I'm not going to say it was a miracle. Sometimes I like to play a game. What if it didn't happen? For example, what if my apartment didn't burn down? Then you wouldn't have moved into the professor's townhouse. Exactly. And then Tommy and TJ wouldn't have a place to live as close to mine. I like this. Do another one. OK. Um, what if you didn't have your brain injury? If I hadn't gotten hurt, then maybe I wouldn't have pursued other experiences like working at the clinic. And that baby wouldn't have had you there. So everything happens for a reason. Whether we can explain it or not. We're all part of a bigger plan. A very unscientific explanation. Maybe, but it helps me get through things. Like leaving home? I'm gonna need more science to make myself feel better about that. Okay. Yeah, no, I got nothing. I'm still not gonna say it was a miracle. Doesn't mean that it wasn't.